is still war and still the greatest scourge. Wherefore today, when into memory surge the pictures of a 16-year-old past, a war we purposed then to be the last, let not our thoughts be mellowed by the chance that we survive to veil romance on France and palliate war. We fought and on the field left human wounds that never will be healed. Those monuments that tell our soldier slain, the country round is cleansed and fresh again, but underneath the soil they sought to free lie men to whom the war was tragedy. in Whitehall, multitudes on this our anniversary of armistice come to renew their pledges to the dead. Sunday it is. Around and overhead peace rules, in spirit with the solemn day when war, war thoughts, war fears were swept away. reverently laid by royal hands, a few stern ceremonial commands, and then the impact of the weighted chime. Most sacred moment in recorded time, and in a hush of reverie sincere, silence descends on mortals everywhere. Rivelli's call is hurled to faith and courage in a timid world, seeming to charge us never to condone war by the symbol of this tragic stone. For once war seems inevitable again, a million martyrs will have died in vain. 